what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here we're gonna be talking about chucky in this video here today more about season four just theorizing and speculating at this point going off of a recent comment made by a very important part of the chucky tv show and that is devin sawa who late last night tweeted out this response to someone who responded to a tweet devin made about his family being stranded somewhere i hope that gets resolved soon for him but he quote tweeted this fan or whoever that person is saying producers have told me to move on i don't know what it means but i guess that's what i am doing sadly now i will say this this does not mean that devin sawa will not be back for chucky season four and the reason why i say that is because while it could mean that devin sawa has already fooled us in the past wasn't Devin Sawa not supposed to be in Chucky season three? And who ended up showing up in Chucky season three? Exactly. However, let's entertain what he's saying and just assume that he will not be back. Is Devin Sawa the only person who's not going to be back? Or are other cast members we've been seeing not going to be back as well? Because I've been seeing the immediate assumption that his comment about producers told him to move on and how he says he doesn't know what it means, but he guess that's what he's doing. There's this assumption that that means the show is canceled, but that doesn't line up with not not that this was confirmed, but the Beyond Scooper or the Beyond Reporter, I should say, and Cinestealth have both tweeted out stuff suggesting that the renewal is imminent. The renewal announcement for season four. Did they decide to pull the plug altogether, or? Is Devin Sawa again just the person who's not going to be returning for the fourth season? Keep in mind, Devin Sawa has played countless roles in this series more than anyone. And I've been saying for the longest time, as much as I love Devin Sawa's contributions to not only my childhood, but the continued presence he has right now in my early adulthood. I appreciate all of it. Devin Sawa is, tr is a tremendous actor. It has been ridiculous for him to keep coming back like that and it is not an anthology show some people will defend it saying it's funny it's not about it being funny or not it's the simple fact that it's just simply not an anthology show at some point it gets old it gets be to become unrealistic and then you'll have the notion of well the show and the concept itself is unrealistic just because something is unrealistic doesn't mean you should keep on adding on and pushing the threshold so far that my suspension of disbelief is being tested. And it is being tested quite a bit when Devin Sawa returns every season in a different role and the trio don't bat an eye about it. Not a single eye. He doesn't look familiar at all. Not a single, not a single fraction of his face looks familiar. Yes, they joked about it, I think, in season two, but seeing them interact with this same person over and over and over again it's it's, it's not i don't think they really interact with him that much in season three although it's been a while since i rewatched season three it's just not it's not cool it's not cool to see the same actor over and over in different roles and the show is not an anthology show has devin Sawa been doing a good job in the roles yes that's not what i'm saying i'm not saying he's been doing a horrendous job it's just time for devin Sawa to stop coming back to this show now let's say the show is canceled i mean big deal you know as some of us chucky fans and i know there are a lot of fans out there who are in the same boat as me we did not start watching this property in 2018 or whenever that reboot dropped we've been watching this property either either since the ip launched in the late 80s if you were around and you've been following it since then i can only feel for you those of you out there who have been through that, how <laughs> you must have gone through so many highs and lows since then. You have those group of fans and then you have fans like myself who maybe came in in the early 2000s, late 90s. So you have 20 plus years of experience with this killer doll and this franchise. It's not a big deal if the show ends for us because at the end of the day, you have 20 plus years of Chucky to keep revisiting for the foreseeable future as long as you continue to be blessed to be on this earth. And in this life, yes, I would hope to see more Chucky in some capacity if they're going to obviously go down the route of giving us the movie Don Mancini has talked about, 
But if the show is canceled, so be it. That's the other reason why it wouldn't be that big a deal to some of us who have been watching Chucky for 20 plus years. Don Mancini's already made it clear that the, sh that the legacy would live on or the IP the franchise would continue to live on in a new movie. And if that's how it's going to live on, the show being canceled will be just a, eh, oh well, nothing, no big loss. Many of us would prefer to see Chucky go back to the movies at this point because of the fact that the show, like I stated in my last video, creatively, I don't see this show evolving. I don't see them ever leaving behind the trio unless the network, of course, has stepped in and is forcing them to do so. And that's what they're about to do in season four. I just don't see the show evolving. I feel like creatively, it's just going to be the same tired shtick. Maybe you'll take a break a season or two but you'll always somehow come back to the trio. And it's like, I'd rather you stop and just go back to the movies if this is what you're gonna do. If this is all we're gonna get for eight episodes, every couple of years, just go back to your movies. Give me Brad Dorf, give me Fiona, give me Jennifer, give me the trio stars. Let's get this back on the big screen in some capacity and let's wrap this up in a big way. That's what I would love ideally as a Chucky fan. And I'm sure a lot of you would love that too, to see Chucky go out in a bang with a big movie. No need to have Megan versus Chucky, but if that's the movie, then that's the movie. I don't think that the show is canceled. I think we will end up getting that renewal announcement soon. If it ends up being a cancellation announcement, I can't even really say I'm that shocked. I just can't. Outside of what I see online and in my own horror sphere, I don't see anyone talking about the Chucky show. I don't see anyone talking about it in a way that suggests it is that popular that the network is really taking a big loss when it loses this show. USA certainly isn't. USA still has a lot of popular shows on its network. Well, I wouldn't say a lot. When I say a lot, I'm specifically thinking about Monday Night Raw. But you guys can let me know what you think about Devin Sawa's comments down in the comment section below. Do you think this means Devin Sawa is the one who's not going to be back? Do you think this means that the show is being canceled? Or do you think Devin Sawa is doing another punt fake situation? Let me know all that down below. If you haven't already, of course, make sure you subscribe. Turn on post notifications if you never miss a video. In the description, I'll have links on my social media accounts. I am on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can message me there, of course. Let me know if there's any movies, news, or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future. And with all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.